Hello dear fans. How to write a social studies essay. The Unified State Exam in Social Studies includes several types of tasks. The most difficult of them is writing a mini-essay, essay, on one of the proposed topics. The fundamental difference between such an essay and essays on literature is that the student needs to clearly and reasonably substantiate his own position in relation to a specific statement or problem. Instructions Step 1. Allocating the correct time for the exam can greatly increase your chances of success. Calculate it so that out of 3, 5 hours to write an essay, you have at least an hour. Postpone the work on the essay until the end of the exam as this question will require your utmost concentration and energy. Step 2. Read and analyze the suggested topics carefully. Stop the choice on the one that you understand. This can be verified by reformulating its title in your own words. In addition, you must have a sufficient baggage of theoretical and practical material necessary for its disclosure. The problem that you describe should reflect the depth of your knowledge of social studies as much as possible. Step 3. Once you have chosen a topic, think carefully about the structure of your work. Find the scientific concepts, definitions, and generalizations that you use when writing your essay. Think over arguments that indicate your personal attitude to the problem at hand. They should draw on the facts of public life in general, as well as your social experience. Make a thesis plan of the essay and write it down in a draft. Step 4. If time permits, write a draft essay. So you can find and correct mistakes and inaccuracies. Start your essay with a clear indication of your own opinion on the issue under consideration. I agree with the words. It seems to me that the statement is not entirely true. Next, formulate your understanding of the statement that became the topic of the essay. Do not repeat the title verbatim. Here, it is important to define its main idea and briefly outline the course of your further reasoning. Step 5. In the main part, provide convincing and well-founded arguments characterizing your position on the problem posed. Use data from various social sciences, facts from social life, and your personal social experience. To substantiate your point of view, three to five arguments are enough, exceeding their number can make the essay vague and cumbersome. Divide the main body of your essay into paragraphs containing one main point. Step 6. The final part of the essay should contain the final conclusion that unites your reasoning. Here you can briefly touch upon the problems that are closely related to the topic, but remained unsolved, mention other aspects and interrelationships in which the topic under consideration gains new meaning. Step 7. At the end of the work, carefully check the text, correct mistakes and incorrect wording. Copy the edited essay into the answer form. Thanks for watching.